Welcome back to JTech Tips. So, in this video, we're going to be opening something brand, brand new. It is the... Oh. Unify Dream Machine Pro from Ubiquity. Um, this was sent over to me by a lovely friend of mine. His name is Jared, so massive thank you to him. Um, and this is going to be a wonderful addition to the network. So, let's get it open. So, because there's literally no room on the desk, we're just going to do it here and hopefully it doesn't fall and break. Like, I've almost broken several um, of my stage lights. <gasps> almost dropped it. Okay, that's really easy. Okay. Woo! Fancy! Okay. Download the quick start guide. No, thank you. It's the Unify Dream Machine Pro! Let's open up. Um, it's actually heavier than I thought it was. Like, I got it from the post office because I missed the delivery yesterday. And it was like six kilograms. Oh, there's a little scratch on the top. That's fine. And, like, yeah, it was covered in scratch. Not scratches. It was, like, really heavy. And I was like, damn. It's heavier than I thought. So, yeah. Slowly. For a router, it's heavy, but it looks very, very nice. And I'm going to situate it where that printer is. It's going to sit on top of there. Uh, what else in the box? It is just brackets. If I was rack mounting it, don't have a rack, so I can sit there for now. Um, basically, that's it. So this is the uh, Dream Machine Pro, not the SE. So this is like the older sort of version, I guess. Um, so it has eight RJ45 ports there, um, two SFP plus, I think that's SFP plus, I think so, could be wrong, don't quote me, uh, two SFP pluses and then another RJ, uh, one gig, well, I think it's one gig, yeah, because on the SE it's two, um, 2.5, so this is a one gig, um, RJ45 for WAN in, um, and then hard drive bay if I was running the protect application, which I'm not, I'll just be running network for now. Um, but yeah, because it's the dream machine, you can run protect, access, talk, network, something else, I'm pretty sure. Um, but yeah, so this is basically all it is. And then um, standard IEC on the back and then the ability for USP, U, yeah, USP connect, which I'm not using, so that's fine. Um, so let's get this plugged in and set up and we'll go from there. So we now have the beautiful UDM plugged in. Um, it is just powering on. Oh, also, I already have a Ubiquiti access point, which I've been running. You probably actually can't see that because of the light. Well, there's an access point. Um, I was running the controller off this server here. Um, but now I can obviously run the network application there. So once it decides to start up, I will load up the amazing Unify app, and I will use that to um, create a new air. What is it called? Create a new site, basically. Yeah, that's the right word, new site. And then I will go from there and set it up. Um, I will do that off camera because I can't bother recording all that now because I've got to do a bunch of other stuff first to keep the old, with the old network and stuff. Uh, there's currently people using it, so I don't want to interrupt them now. So I'm going to end the video here. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Um, I hope you enjoy the video. Like and subscribe. And hopefully we will see more content regarding the UDM Pro. See you guys.